Okay, so I just wanted to show you what happened um, during a neutralization reaction. So I've got some hydrochloric acid already in my polystyrene cup here. I've put 25 milliliters in and I'm going to take the temperature of it, the starting temperature, and then I'm going to add 25 milliliters of sodium hydroxide. This is an alkali and it should neutralize the acid that's in my polystyrene cup. We can see whether the temperature goes up or down. When we've recorded that maximum temperature change, I'm then going to add another 25 millilitres of alkali to it. Now at that point, I'm hoping there will be no acid left for it to react with. And we can have a think about what might happen to my temperature at that stage. So let's take the starting temperature first of all. I don't know if you can see that, I think it's on 19 degrees. Okay, so I'm now going to add my alkali to it and watch what happens to the temperature. I'm stirring as usual to make sure the heat's distributed evenly through the liquid. And you can see there has been quite a temperature change already. Let's see if we can see what the maximum temperature change is. I think it's on 32 degrees. I don't know if you agree with me. Now, I'm going to add some more sodium hydroxide to this. Now this sodium hydroxide has been in the room and is the same starting temperature as my acid originally was. So this is about 19 degrees C and I wonder if you think what would happen as I add it to my mixture here. Is it going to carry on going up and carry on reacting with acid? Is it going to stay the same temperature or is the temperature going to go down? What do you think will happen? Well, I think the temperature has started to change. Do you agree with me? Has it gone up? Has it gone down? Has it stayed the same? What do you think has happened?